What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video of my Let's Play 7 Days to Die Alpha 18. How are we doing? Hope we are all well. So, what I wanted to do today is I wanted to break into this prison here. Never gone through the prison before, so I want to see what it's all about. Um, right now, just checking out a few bits and pieces here just to see if there's anything that I can use um, for myself. Because right now, at the moment, um, I forgot to take some medical supplies along with me for today, uh, today's Let's Play. And yeah, that's going to um, propose a bit of a challenge for me. So we'll see how we will go with that. But what I did was I did actually make the run back to home base um, overnight. And I pretty much got myself all um, deluded, And we are essentially good to go. So as you can see here, I've got nothing I need to worry about with um, in terms of uh, uh, loot and all that sort of good stuff. So... Oh, well, we've got a military guy here waiting to say g'day to us here, so let's go ahead and deal with you, since you're, you're so eager to say hello to us. And make sure that you're dead, of course. Alright, so what do we have in here? Nothing in the desk there that I really want to take with me. And this looks really, really, um, you know, look very well presented here, so I'm really interested to see exactly how this all sort of, you know, pans out, I guess. So I was going to go into the main gates, and now that um, our military guy was gracious enough to sort of uh, greet us, we can sort of um, take one other avenue and go through that way. Actually, what I might do is, let's just quickly go back, because I just realised, where's this? Nope, I wanted this. Take that. Um, I don't need that, but I do want to scrap that. And the reason why I'm going to scrap that is I'm going to get some bandages out of it. So may as well do that while I'm on the go. And if I get any other sort of um, uh, clothing that I don't need, I'll just do the go ahead and do the same thing. Why not? Alrighty, so now we are back up top here. We've got a spotlight, a floodlight, sorry, up here. Um, really, there's nothing up here. Okay. So it's good to get a bit of an overview to give us a bit of an idea on what this sort of place looks like. So you've got the, um, the courtyard over here, and then we've got everything else that's inside there. So, yeah, we'll go around, check out that pillar over there. Um, I'll see if we can get it over there. I think we can, and we can definitely go inside and have a bit of a peek ski. So oh, let's get our way out of here. I think we'll... Oh, didn't realise there was a wall safe. So let's go ahead and grab the wall safe. Hopefully we can open him up. First go. Fingers crossed, of course. And see what we have. Nope. Hopefully we'll get something decent out of it. Unless if, unless if you're going to be a bit of a stubborn one, which you are. Which I really hate these things, I swear. Anyway, there we go. And only for some mods. Well, a mod, really. Alright. This would be a really cool place to sort of hang out in and use as your own sort of base if you really wanted to sort of go down that way. But, again, that's depending on the individual, I guess. Alright. What I might do is I might just bandage up. Oop. Didn't mean to do that. Alright. Is anyone up here? There's really nothing up here. I doubt that there's going to be much of anything up top here. So, like I said, I'm more inclined to take a look, see what's out here. And if there's anything that I can pick up, I'll pick up. But if not, you know, is what it is. Okay, so that had absolutely nothing. So, whoop, Hopefully you guys don't get um, dizzy with that. But, <laughs> oh, hey, didn't see you. And you were a feral. Alright. And I'm guessing there's someone else out here. Ah, that was you before. Alrighty. Okay, so. Interested to know where you actually came from. Hmm. Anyway. Let's make our own way in, of course. Bang open this. Here we go. Very good. Hopefully there's no mines in here as well. This is the wasteland, of course, so anything can really happen. So I guess I'll just have my guard up a little bit. Oh, that was a snake. I thought that was 
like a bear or something. Oh, I had no idea what that was. All right, well, let's, um, oh, you, you're there. Poor snake, you can't even get through. Let's see if I can actually hit him from here. Thank you. And I might just take your meat, no problem. And uh, this is going to sort of take us in to the main section here anyway. Ah, hey nurse. Out of the infirmary. Ooh, didn't see you. Skater punk. Too many, um, too much graffiti and tagging, no doubt. But I'm not about to open up things in here unless if there's a safe, I'm not going to go in there. There's reinforced concrete like crazy. Um, it's not going to be any sort of point in me doing that, honestly. Uh, we've got a pistol gun there. There was an ex-convict may have been hiding that beforehand, as you would. Um, there's some toilet water there that I'm not interested in. And was there anything here? Leave those alone. I think we looted that. Uh, so let's go up to level 2. There is someone trying to get to us. I don't know where you might be. I think you might be on the bottom level. Um, I'll go ahead and scrap that. Oh, is someone there? No. Alright, anyway. I will not deal with them. Let's just continue on. See what's what. Nothing there. Okay. Yeah, it's really not one of those real interesting POIs to begin with. I don't know whether or not there is something around for me to, you know, take a look, check out, all that sort of stuff. Alright, well, well we've got a guy in a hazmat suit here, waiting to, wanting to come see us. So, we'll deal with you right now. We'll take you out nice and easy. And this is all connected down this way. That's all well and good. And there's actually no way to get in here, so I don't confused as to where he actually came from. Not too sure where he came from to be honest with you. Oh well. Look. Well what I'll do is I'll bust open this end here. See what's what. And if there's anything that I can you know take a bit of a peek ski around. Well that's also locked. So we'll bust open this thing as well. There we go. Couldn't be bothered switching. That was me being lazy. Alright. Nothing here, nothing here. I think he, someone over here is doing their best to try and get in. I'm not too sure what's up with that. Alright, let's have a look. Oh, there is a toilet. And a shower, but there's nothing in here for me to to obtain, unfortunately. All right, so we'll um, move over to here, see what's what, see if there's anything different, I guess. And there is. Ooh. All right. All right. Cool. I want to bust open this thing first, and if I can get this thing open up nice and quick, I'll go to the small safe. Um, I'll b I would rather burn all the lockpicks on this without having to sit here and try and bash to death this safe um, to open up with my pickaxe, so this would probably be the way to do it. And look at that, first go. I think someone's broken in. I can hear someone. I honestly don't know where you guys are. It's you. Look at you. Ooh, I just clocked him. Nice. Uh, okay. Right. Well, what I might do is... Can I bust that? I don't think I can. Oh, I guess I can. That was weird. I'll just open that, that up for now and just give us a bit of a pathway to come in. Anyway, let's um, unlock this, see how we go with this one here. And we'll loot up the, the area and see what we get out of it. Hopefully we'll get some decent items. Um, I'll be really happy if I do get a pump shotgun out of this. Um, you would think in a prison that you might get something like that, but, you know, I said that before in a shotgun messiah t on two occasions, not just one, um, that I was hoping to get one and I never did. 
so that was a bit of a pain but what do you do and this wall safe is becoming a bit of a pain why won't you allow me to get in there how much picks do I have left well I've got, I've got a whole bunch of lock picks anyway so I'm gonna get in here eventually but I do not know why you're stubborn really come on buddy behave honestly come on come on you can do it there we go perfect and for that oh there you go pump shotgun it's only a level one wouldn't mind a better quality one I probably should have been a little bit more specific with that but what do you do compound bow got some ammo some mods what do we get in here okay not the greatest but something I guess okay so that is pretty much it for this part here it's pretty easy to sort of get in to be honest if I'm being perfectly honest with you guys definitely want to see what's around here there's, there's a couple of zombies that have been coming around here or out of here really I just want to see what this is all about and if there's anything really interesting here then you know we'll suss it out I guess um, but it doesn't appear to be that way either there we go, just the usual suspects here, Re nothing to be honest. So we'll um, just head on out. Pop. And can I go around the other end? Which I cannot, so I might have to actually bust my way through. And there we go. One and two. And honestly, if you really got if you guys really wanted to secure this base well this POI you really could and it wouldn't be really too hard or difficult for you guys to do so and to be honest it, it is a really big base if you guys really wanted to do something like this but I mean if this wasn't in the wasteland I think I may have considered it if I had found it very early on in my let's play uh, to have my own base here because the reason for that is you can really turn it into a horde base if you wanted to You've got four towers here that you can sort of work from. You can jump in the middle here if you really wanted to and all that sort of good stuff. And yeah, I don't know. It could have probably, you know, it could have eventuated into something that, you know, you could have actually used. So yeah, there's that. Anyway, that is the prison. Nice and easy. So we'll get, we'll get on out of here. What I wanted to do from from here was wanted to do a little bit more um, exploring and traveling of course and you know just to see what else there is to do in this particular biome here I'll have to get rid of that because I don't need that anymore um, what I can do from here there's a couple ways that I can leave it I can sort of go out this way which I may not do because I'm fearing of radiation and all that sort of stuff so I'm probably gonna be more inclined to go down this way and what I'm thinking is it should hook us up back to this road here somehow. Um, how? I'm not too sure. But what I might do is we'll get going. So I'm just going to get our jeep over here to get ready and get ready to mobilize and roll out, of course. And there's no bear here. I don't know where it went off to. In the last video, I did see there was a bear, but. He's not there anymore so he must have uh, nicked off anyway what I might do is I'll do some exploring if there's anything interesting any sort of um, point of interest that I might may want to consider to loot um, we'll go ahead and check it out and yeah I'll see you guys then alrighty so checking out this POI here oh sorry this area of the map here haven't found anything really interesting to be honest with you so we may continue on and keep moving on but, hang on, there is the waterworks. Hmm. You know what? I might just do the waterworks and only... I might just grab the, um, where the, the main loot is. May as well grab all of that, because why not? So, to get there, you just have to go into here. Unfortunately, I did not bring a shovel with me, which is gonna hurt me. But, that should not be an issue with this, because it's all, um... It's all garbage, I guess. It's all crap when you look at it. So we'll just bust open all this. I'm getting some iron as well at the same time. If I just, 
I think I was just breaking the um the hatch there. Anyway. So may as well ooh 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 nearly. Nearly killed myself. Anyway, we'll um bust open this. So I've got a bit of a walkway. Do I have any ammo? I do. Gonna have to use this bad boy here. Because I know there's gonna be some pretty bad people here. Let's just take you out. Nice. And there's another Hawaiian boy over there. Just drop him. See if he gets up. I don't know if he will get up. I don't know if I just... I don't know. He did. Oop. I think I've woken up everyone. Here we go. Ooh, here we go. Alright, we've got an irradiator here. Let's just go ahead and take you out. And we got military, Hawaiian. I don't think I... I can't believe I actually killed the irradiator that easily. Anyone else? Is there anyone else? Really? Alright. Hey, I'm not complaining. Let's just go ahead and bust everything up. If there's anyone that's going to hassle me, hassle me. Why not? Alright, let's see if we can get this big, big chest boy open. See what's what. Alright, let's see what we got out of him. Good. Let's just open up this first. Ooh. I forgot to de-loot. Oh, that was smart, wasn't it? Oh, no, 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 no. I want to get the mod. I want to get the mod. Thank you very much. Alright, what I might do is... Quickly... Oh my god. Alright, this is going to serve an absolute pain if I don't get myself out of there properly. Alright, let's interact with our truck here. Let's drop all of this that I will work out later on. Don't know why I carried that with me, but I did. Take all of that. Cool. Alright, and... Let's head back down, grab all the good loot, see what's what. Okay, loot at that. I did hear someone. Should be alright. I heard a dog. And I think he's, he's in, a, in a bit of a an attack with someone, but that's alright. Because I'll be long gone by the time they get down here, I'll tell you that now. Um, yeah, alright. So... They're duking it out over there somewhere. Anyway, you guys have fun with that. I am out of here. And I think that's it for this part here. Really, there wasn't much of anything that I was really interested in. So, alright, so long guys. I'm out of here. And honestly, I think there's really not much around here. We did check. I did check out a few things here and there, but didn't see any, anything that I was interested in. So, um, we'll head out this way see if there's anything that I might find and yeah I'll see you guys in a moment alrighty guys thought I'd take a bit of a pit stop check out the local scenery here to be honest there is really not much else for us to look at so I did do some traveling so we did get ourselves out of this area over here which was sort of pretty much covered we were over there beforehand and I really didn't want to go down this path over here because not knowing exactly what's going to be down there but anyway found ourselves in a bit of a mix between the um, desert and the burnt biome and I did go up here just to make sure that this pathway did connect which is a, a much easier shortcut if I um, if I really wanted to sort of connect myself over through here but I'll be bypassing the traders that we've got over here and here so um, it is what it is so you can't really sort of bypass any of that and the only other thing in the burn biome that I was able to see is a couple of mil military bunkers and things like that there but what I did notice was this little fella which I don't think I've looted here before yet so it is locked meaning that I haven't looted it and if you guys ever see this little house with this little well here um, if you guys can 100% you guys need to loot up this place I think I've, I think I've done this a couple of times already in this let's play but if you haven't seen it seen the previous let's plays um, do check all of that out because um, you you won't you won't be disappointed when you jump down here because this is free loot essentially that I'm gonna be grabbing here in a second guys so 
um, free loot, even if you really wanted to, this is a really um, secure base as well for yourselves. If you can get through that, which I'm not going to, I'm going to pretty much take this thing out anyway, but if you can sort of take that out, or even take this out for now, fix it up, and then eventually start working on the, um, the door here, and if you break that open, make your own door kind of thing, then you can obviously fix this up without an issue. And to be honest, you've got a really good spec to help bunk up. And yeah, I would 100% would uh, definitely use this type of POI for a base, just so I can have, you know, my own little personal space here. I don't really need to do any sort of renovations. Everything's all nicely spaced out, as you can see. Um, you've got some pretty cool little bits and pieces in here that you can sort of go ahead and find. Um, yeah, it's actually a really, really good all-round um, type of base. Yes, there's going to be zombies that will definitely hear, hear you and things like that. Um, what I would probably suggest is just make sure that you've um, uh, fixed up that little hatch up there. That is very close. you above me. So that'll be either in the house or there might be a roaming zombie around that might sort of, you know, um, have a bit of an interest in you or anything like that. So... Yeah, that's probably the only thing that you just want to be concerned about. Other than that, I think you'd be pretty safe here. That's just my own personal opinion on that. Um, what I might do is I might as well wrench these things up because I want to get the springs out of it. And I should get some okay amount of springs out of this. Which I am, which is good. Getting a bit of cloth. 16, and I'll get a little bit more out of this. Look at that, 24 springs. Actually, not too bad, to be honest. Alright, what have we got in here? Ooh, generator. Uh, okay. I thought I'd get something nice out of that, but not so much. Um, and, yeah, for all of your amenities, you've got a cooking pot to start off with as well. So, it is actually a really good place to, you know, set up shop. If you needed it, of course. If you're lucky to find it to begin with, 100%. You really want to make sure that you um, loot this place here. But we'll um, definitely go into here because that's where all the good loot is. And we'll suss out what's what as we sort of, you know, break this fella down here. So this shouldn't really take us too long to get through. It's only 2,500 here, points. So with a level 5 pickaxe, fully modded, of course, you not have a problem in getting in that and yeah they're, they're running around they're freaking out trying to find out where you are that's always to be expected a couple of bookcases here oh nice awesome so i've got the ability to make the gyrocopter i believe which is good um nothing in there yeah and look to be honest if they manage to get themselves down here good on them but there won't there won't be a lot of them coming down through here so you'll be able to you know, deal with it, so, there's that, ooh, was that, that powerful, really, oh, okay, so you get, ooh, okay, so I'm not going to need much of this or this, um, I might as well scrap and scrap, and let's just eat, we might be hungry, who knows, scrap that, don't want that, um, what can I, Oh, well, right, let's just use that for the experience, and that's 200 Duke, so I want to hang on to that. That, I will go ahead and scrap. Got a decent amount of repair kits, which is really good. Alright, should be right now. Um, so, I'll go ahead and take that. That sells, that I can read. Very good. Let's see what we got in here. Washing machine, nothing. That just exploded. And what do we got here? Okay, scrap and scrap. And what's in this military case? Ooh, not bad. Not bad at all. I shall take all of that. Thank you very much. And gun safe. Let's see what we have in here. Hopefully we'll have something decent. But level six marksman rifle, not bad. Not bad, so I'm pretty happy with that. Okay, we're getting, oh. Just watching my six, as you do. I should probably have the, the shotgun now, uh, the pump shotgun behind me, or the sh pump shotgun turret. 
behind me. Um, but that's alright, you gotta live life dangerously sometimes. So you get some okay loot. Again, it's the luck of the draw, so there's only so much that you can you know, sort of hope for, I guess. But that's pretty much it. And that's pretty much a good little visual tour. This guy was freaking out, wondering where the hell I was. And yeah, dealt with you pretty easily, so. Anyway, here's where I'm parked up. And pretty much, honestly, I think we've done this little expedition to all ends, all to where it needs to be, honestly, with you guys, so I think it's probably a good time to go ahead and leave it here, because otherwise I've connected the dots here, and we're pretty much back to where that trader is, and more or less, I can more or less find my way back home, which is further up here, which I haven't been back in a while. Oh, come on, buddy. I don't need to deal with you right now. So I may as well head back. As I said, there's not much else for me to you know, look at here. And I really don't want to sort of spend too much time in the burn biome, to be honest. It's all dark and janky. And honestly, I don't think there's really anything interesting out there. So that's just my opinion on that. But look, that concludes the little expedition of um, this little series, or mini-series, I should say, rather. Because, um, yeah. I mean, you know what? I think I might actually head back that way. That might be a better way of doing it. Anyway, sort of thinking out loud to myself. But yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Um, hopefully you enjoyed you know, this little expedition here. I think we might do some building next. I'm not too sure what I want to do with building and all that sort of stuff. But um, I'm sure I'll find something. And hopefully you guys will you know, hop on over and check it out. So if you ended up enjoying this video, make sure you hit the like button. Comment down below. Um, and share the video if possible that would be really really helpful and if you guys are new to the channel enjoy your taste of seven days to die then consider subscribing and hitting the notification bell icon so you don't miss out on any future videos anyway guys i'm out of here take it easy and catch you next time